niacinamide. Is this an ugly duckling? Not really a hero ingredient. Some people have never heard about it. But then the ugly duckling transforms itself into a beautiful swan and your skin is that of a prince or a princess. I like it. Welcome to DH Traveler, a channel where we try to hunt down swans, skincare swans. Beautiful ingredients, beautiful products, we shake up ideas and we talk passionately about skincare. My name is Custodio, I try to build a voice for the skincare industry. Yes, I know, I'm one of those annoying persons who loves their job, who wakes up in the morning already excited, thinking about beautiful ingredients and ideas for products, or because traveling to a country where he's gonna talk about his babies, his products, he's gonna have some press conference or talk with education teams and marketing teams. And well, what can I say? So today I talk about niacinamide, which is one of my favorite ingredients, which is one of my skin favorite ingredients, because I'm a believer that we should always listen to our skin and understand what our skin accepts and, and craves and is in love with. So niacinamide, it's one of mine. I'm not sure if you have the same experience or if it has been under your radar. I will try in the end of the video to also suggest you some specific products and the good ways to include niacinamide. Uh, in your skincare regimen. And for believing so much in listening to the skin, I try to listen to the skin also as a biological entity, as an organ. And I have built for myself and to share with all of you what I call the perfect formula pyramid, trying to assemble an ocean of ingredients out there, which can be very overwhelming and very often very confusing because depending on which voice, which marketing voice are we listening to, we are torn from left to right saying that this ingredient is going to save your life and that ingredient. Well, I believe in skin as the bigger picture. So I think that the perfect formula, it's a combination of several ingredients, not one, two or three ingredients. And I also want to open the dialogue that not always the highest concentrations are necessarily the best performance. We should always think the balance and something that can daily make your skin feel happy. So welcome to DH Traveler. If it's the first time, I will of course expect you to listen to the end and then maybe visit some of the past videos. If you already have seen other videos, I hope niacinamide it's something that's gonna excite you. So when I talk about the perfect formula pyramid, you will see in the previous videos that we've been building and there is a lot to build still going forward. We are just halfway, not even halfway. We are less than halfway. We are now in the core of the pyramid. So we have built the basis. You can see those videos. Uh, we are now in the core of the pyramid, which refers to the strength, to the barrier, to the functionalities where skin becomes more resilient and stronger. And niacinamide is such an important part of that. I'm trying to nail it to three main areas. One, which is super dear to my heart, it's anti-inflammatory. Niacinamide counteracts many uh, inflammatory chain reactions and especially those related to the UV exposure. So the UV rays, the daylight, the sunlight uh, being the number one cause for aging, just take note that niacinamide not being a filter, not that niacinamide in any way minimizes the exposure, so it's not protecting your skin from the sun, but it's acting on the DNA repair from the sun damages. Now, something new I never talked about, which is the second of the three benefits I want to highlight for niacinamide. And this is that niacinamide boosts the synthesis of ceramides, mouthful of ingredients. Ceramides being a part of the core of the pyramid, so we will dedicate a specific video only to talk about ceramides, but get already the idea 
in case you don't know what ceramides stand for, they are natural occurring lipids, not in the sebum. They are intercellular lipids, so deeper in the layers of the epidermis, and they connect uh, cellular keratin material to make a wall, to make the bricks, the cellular bricks, stick together. So it's an essential, crucial element for skin barrier. Just figure out that niacinamide also boosts the skin's own production of ceramide. So if you want to have a good barrier, if you want to have a consistent wall, niacinamide should be part of your game. And the third benefit, it's a dear darling for everybody who worries about pigmentation, pigmentation spots, and even skin complexion, because niacinamide, it's one additional fighter in the path against uneven pigmentation. So now you understand why you should mark my words that niacinamide is an ugly duckling because it can be a swan for so many people. It can be a swan for oily skin types because it's anti-inflammatory action. It's actually targeting the sebaceous glands and the oil production. So over time, it can actually slow down the production of sebum. So a friend for acne prone and oily skin. Since it's boosting the synthesis of ceramides, it's also a great friend for fragile skin, even drier skin conditions, skin which are dealing with the disrupture of the barrier function. And last, but definitely the big sparkle here, for pigmentation prone skin, as we've seen, reduces the transfer of melanin. So in my opinion, it's clearly something that you should not ignore. At the same time, I repeat it, it's zero sensitizing. It's not photosensitizing. So it can be used during the day, it can be used during the night. It's not in any way an ingredient which causes question marks and a lot of reserves. So surprise, surprise, something from my Swiss line. We are developing this beautiful Peace Booster, which is coming, you heard, peace for peace, making peace with everybody and with yourself. 5% niacinamide, so the tested 5%, I consider the high level threshold for all year round, with 2% tranexamic acid, so a very anti-redness, anti-rosacea, anti-inflammatory type of booster is coming out in September, stay tuned. More two products I love, Alpha H, Vitamin B, plus the copper uh, peptide. This is a very gentle and very anti-aging geared because uh, the copper peptide has very interesting evidence also as an anti-ager. SkinCeuticals Metacell B3, which is an emulsion containing the right amount of uh, niacinamide and many other beneficial ingredients. I would say if you also look for a more self-sufficient instead of a booster, but more of an all in one, all in one moisturizer with the right concentration of niacinamide. As I mentioned, oily skin, I want to highlight if uh, control oil, it's what you are seeking or addressing blemishes and imperfections uh, with your niacinamide. There is one of my fetish products, which is uh, from Biologique Recherche, Crème Dermopurifiant, which is maybe the ugliest product that I have in my collection. You see, it's another ugly duckling. The color has nothing to do with niacinamide. It has a, a huge amount of yeasts and very purifying uh, type of ingredients together with niacinamide, which give it this not so pleasant color. But I can tell you, if you deal with oily skin problems and you want to find niacinamide, this is a very interesting way to go. And as I'm always in love with my own brand, I also want to highlight our magic eye mask from Cell Shock which is already a classic in the line, but we have just reformulated and relaunched it. So the same 5% niacinamide as before, but now with enzymes from pumpkin and probiotics and also ingredients to make this brightness for the eye area. It can be used as an eye mask, Overnight, even you sleep with it and next morning you wake up to a brighter you or even better, you use it as a concealer daily, every day, 
above your usual eye cream, just the minor, minor, tiniest dot. And you deliver the product from the back after you have cooled your eye area. And this tiniest amount will be enough for you to conceal both eyes, all area around eyes, and that, that luminosity and that skincare benefit at the same time, which will just make the entire area much more luminous and the benefits of 5% niacinamide. And the beauty of it is that you can have a concealer with niacinamide at the same time. So I really challenge you skincare gurus and skincare obsessed people out there, troubled souls like me, just go out and try to find a concealer with 5% niacinamide. So clearly, what can I do now? Only thing I can do is to offer someone to a lucky moment to get a free magic eye mask. So as usual, write to DH Traveler, leave some comments below, and I will come back. And the winner, if you feel good about it, then email me a picture so that I can share with everybody. So this is it, nice cinemite. Everybody can be a swan if you find the right ingredients, if you combine the right ingredients at the right percentage. I hope to always be helpful for you and to see you again and again at DH Traveler. So I say goodbye as always with a beautiful tie. By the way, speaking of ties, last video on the vitamin C, I was bragging about my Gucci Tom Ford period tie and the lady wrote that when I showed the tie on the camera, it was not visible enough because I was talking about the flamingos and she could not see the flamingos. So I'm just posting now a picture of the flamingos from last tie and the new tie, which is a no brand tie. And I love this tie, even though there is no brand. Who cares about the brands? Unless it's Gucci, Chanel, um, Hermes, and so on. I'm so superficial. Say no to boring skincare and to boring ties. So do you want to be a swan? Stay connected with DH Traveler, like, activate the bell and subscribe the channel in case you haven't done that already.